And welcome to the Bear Country High School basketball post-game report. The Frontier Red Hawks escape at home against the Turner's Falls Thunder by a single point. 57-56 is our final score. Jeff and Chris courtside, Dave Reno in our Greenfield studios. What a ball game here tonight, Chris. Turner's Falls under man for sure, giving Frontier everything and then some, but for Frontier, the bigs were big tonight. Yeah, I think escape is the, is the proper word to use to describe this win. It wasn't Frontier's most even performance of the season, but it is a W, and credit to Turner's Falls Thunder for coming in here. Upset-minded, again, as you mentioned, on the tournament bubble, and they played a strong game and probably played Frontier as strong as any team has in the Hampshire League this season. But you're absolutely right. The Bigs came to play inside Peter Carey. A tremendous performance by Colin Boudreaux, I thought. And uh, it's all around, I think, interior-wise, a pretty solid performance. But they did not make it easy. Turner's Falls did not make it easy for Frontier inside or outside uh, with the basketball. And Frontier didn't help themselves that much at times. But it was enough for a win. A, a win by one point is as good as a win by 40. For those of you listening that weren't with us at the start of the game, Chase Novak did not start uh, tonight for the Turner's Falls Thunder. Both Driscoll brothers did start. They both played well, but a big boost off the bench by uh, for Chase Novak. He nearly got them the win here on the road. Yeah, I told you at the halftime, I said, he's going to be the X factor in the second half. And he ended up with 12 points in the second half, 24 for the game to lead all scorers. Um, Anthony Peterson hit a key three at the end to get them to within a, a bucket. Uh, just at the end, it was just, it was, I think Frontier's depth and, and their, their bench play and the, the variety of combinations that Ben Barczewski could put out on the floor at any given time, I think it was a numbers game. That made it tough for Turner's Falls coming in, but credit Thunder for coming in here, sticking their head in the lion's mouth and very nearly coming away with a big upset win. 57-56 is our final score. Plenty of candidates for Helen, the chemical player of the game, but we finally did narrow it down. We will reveal the winner in just a minute, but Chris, I'll have you run the final numbers here. Okay, for the Thunder, leading all scorers, as I mentioned, Chase Novak with 24 points, eight for Liam Driscoll, eight for Marcus Sanders, 10 for Anthony Peterson, including a big three at the end, four for Brendan Driscoll, and a solid performance defensively as well, and two points for Jaden Whiting. For the Frontier Redhawks, Peter Carey with 21 points to lead his team, 13 for Colin Boudreau, nine for Sean Richter, came on strong at the end, seven for Donovan Hoffman, four for Owen Walkowitz, and a three-pointer for Brett Robinson, 57-56 is the final score. All right, before we wrap it up here, hell on a chemical player of the game. And uh, as I mentioned, the bigs truly were big tonight. And uh, one of them actually is going to come away with that T-shirt. Yeah, Colin Boudreaux, I think, you know, ordinarily you might think Peter Carey with the 21 points. Yep. But I really think in terms of key plays and key moments, Colin Boudreau uh, made some tremendous, tremendous plays, especially in the second half at the very end. A couple of key buckets at the end, some good defensive plays. And again, I think you could give it to either one of them. But I think he, in this case, Colin Boudreau was more of an impact, and he gets the T-shirt tonight. All right, so congratulations to Frontier Regional's Colin Boudreaux. He is the Helena Chemical Player of the Game in Frontier's 57-56 victory over the Turner's Falls Thunder. So the Frontier train keeps on a chugging, and for Turner's Falls now, nine losses on the season. And uh, that bubble, it's not burst, but it's getting a little close. But again, a great effort here tonight on the road at Frontier, losing by just one. For Chris Collins and for Dave Reno, I'm Jeff Terrell. Thanks a lot for joining us tonight. Have a great night in bear country, everyone.